Shalom. Before I start, I want to give all honors and glories and praises to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Yahweh Kakodash, Yahweh, which is the one true name of the Heavenly Father, Yahweh Shai, who the world eagerly calls Jesus Christ, but his one true name is Yahweh Shai. I would like to give double honors to the elders and apostles of Green Millstone, because those are the men who I've learned this truth from through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Peace, blessings, salutations to the whole for the elect. And Shalom to you, sincere brother scattered abroad, pushing forth this word in truth and sincerity. I am the brother Mashiach Arazaka from the Servants of Yahweh Wai Yahweh Shai Camp, Las Vegas, Nevada branch. And uh, pretty much this lesson um, is basically just going to be uh, 2 Timothy uh, 2 and, and verse 3 to 4. I just did a lesson about um, endure, your, um, endure your own measures of temptation. So this is like this will be like a part two. This is just a one, a two preset breakdown because I, I couldn't think of it through the spirit. And once I turned the video off, then I wind up getting this preset in the head. So it happens to me. So so like it. This is a quick hitter. Lord Wounds, that's is edifying. This is Second Timothy two and three. It says, "Thou therefore endure hardness." Right. So you individually have to endure hardness, right? As a good soldier in this truth of Yahweh Bashim Hashai. So let's read it again, 2 Timothy 2 and 3. It says, Thou therefore endure hardness as a good soldier of Yahweh Shai Hamashiach. So right, the Lord called you into this thing. And when you're called into this thing, and you start being in tune with the elders and apostles of Great Millstone, and you're learning from those men, and you're studying to show yourself approved, and you're being weaned off the milk, according to uh, Isaiah uh, chapter 28, verse uh, 8 through 9, right? You're being weaned from the milk. Whom shall he teach doctrine? Right? So when you're weaned off that milk, now you're coming into the truth. Now you have to be a good soldier for your Yahweh Shemashai. And you have to go out to the highways and byways and present your body up as a living sacrifice. There's no if or ands or buts about that. All right? You have to make your calling an election sure, as the scriptures say in 1 Peter uh, 1 and 10. So you have to make your calling an election sure. You have to do that. You have to endure hardness as a good soldier. So regardless of what is thrown at you, you have to endure through the end, Lord willing, if the Lord keeps you in the spirit. Because there's individuals that couldn't handle the afflictions in this thing, and they wind up losing the faith, and then they fell out. You don't want to be those individuals, because the Lord can take the spirit from you. This is 2 Timothy 2 and 4. It says, no man that wore from tangle himself with the affairs of this life. Because the affairs of this life is going to be a lot of downfalls. It's going to be a huge downfall, Salakia, for a lot of individuals in the truth. Those that are proclaiming to be in the truth and they so busy and still embedded in the things of the world. Or they're a Jake that's a two-third and they're embedded in the things of the world. And they saw those men out on the street corners teaching and they didn't want to learn. They didn't want to get this truth. They didn't care for it. They're going to be messed up individuals in this thing. So you want to make sure... Like I said, you a Jake that's in this truth and you're new to my video. You want to follow Great Millstone Hebrew Israelites. Those are the men that the Lord set up. And through those men, Lord willing, we're going to receive salvation. 2 Timothy 2 and 4. No man that wore and tangled himself with the affairs of his life. Because we don't do that. We don't we don't try to fit in in this society. We 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 who cares about that? We don't care about that. We don't care about fitting into this society. This this place is about to be destroyed. We don't give a fuck about fitting into this society. We don't care about that. We care about Yahweh Bashim Hashai. We care about doing His work and His will. That's what we care about. We don't give a we don't give a fuck about this place called America. We don't care about Babylon. We don't give a fuck about it. It says that He may please Him who have been chosen to Him to be a soldier, right? Because you didn't choose the Lord. The Lord chose you into this thing. The Lord chose you into this thing. So. It's a blessing to be chosen into this thing, to be called into this thing. But you want to be the chosen at the end, though. Because at the end, the Lord is going to have a chosen. You don't want to just be the called. It's a blessing to be in this thing. And you, Lord willing, the Lord keeps us in the spirit to continually endure in this thing. Because you don't know what your lot is. You, you, might, you, you, you might fall out of truth. I pray none of that happens to any one of us, including myself. I pray the Lord keeps us in the spirit to continually do his work, do his will. So, hey, I just want to do a quick hitter on that. Lord one is that fine. I want to give all honors and glory and praise to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Yahweh Kakodash. 
And double honors to the elders and apostle Great Millstone. Peace, blessings, salutations, and hopeful elect. Shalom to you, sincere brother, scattered abroad, pushing forth this word in truth and sincerity. I am the brother Mashiach Arazaka from the servants of Yahweh, Yahweh Shai Camp, Las Vegas, Nevada branch. And Lord willing, this lesson was edifying. Until next time I say, Shalom.